Hey guys, it's uh, Adam of Purple Guitars with uh, I think the latest uh, Dog Bowl Resonator. Uh, it is complete. Um, wow, it's taken a while. Very patient customer. A couple of changes to uh, the standard um, the standard run of them that I've got. One of the biggest differences is uh, we've got actually got a set neck. It's uh, not bolted in. It's actually a glued in neck. Um, this particular one has got. Uh, a victory pickup by Wade Costumbater. Um and it's just I, I love absolutely love um, yeah I mean you know I love my mortal coil pickups but I mean it's it's like if you have the same cheese on a sandwich all the time it's you know it's you know you want to change things up a little bit um, these pickups are absolutely fantastic they're just they're full of attitude <laughs> So it's quite, the other thing that's really cool about it is, it's also, the, the pickup itself, um, it's, a, it's really kind of low fi um, it's the dog looking for his ball, um, it's still, it's very kind of low fi so it's still really within the idea of the, um, the cigar box guitar kind of vibe, so it's, it's, loves amplifiers, um, couple of the chat, that's the dog bowl on the back, you can see that, there's the feedback, <laughs> so, um, Little forearm chamfer just just here, which I which is the first I've actually done on these. So I'll continue doing doing that. We've got your aluminium um, your aluminium uh, string retainer at the back. That's actually where the, where the guitar's grounded. Uh, so it's actually grounded from here to the uh, to the output jack. Uh, you got your volume here and your tone, both CTS pots uh, with a orange drop um, capacitor, um, 0.22 capacitor. We've got. Um, River she oak for the 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 bridge. Uh, the biscuit is actually um, it's the hole cut out of the uh, the, t the Monte Cristo boxes, the bottom of the Monte Cristo boxes that I use for the Lightning Boys. I actually keep these, um, so I reuse those um, as the as the biscuit for the for the dog bowl. Um, we've got Wilkinson tuners on the back. <laughs> So you will notice that there are no frets on this. Um, I usually this is a customer request um, for a fretless uh, fretless version of this guitar, um, which I'm really happy with. Um, these guitars are a made to order instrument. Uh, you can find them on uh, the website at www.birdwoodguitars.com. Um, I'm stoked. I'm gonna double check and make sure I'm 100% happy with everything. I e will give me a couple of days to play with it uh, before I send it off to uh, to uh, my customer. And uh That's on the this, this crappy little little amp that I've got. It's my little shop amp. Of course, I'll figure if it uh, if it sounds okay on that, it's going to sound good through something bigger. So you can really hear how the um, how the dog bowl actually affects how the dog bowl actually affects the tone. I'm not using one of my um, um, uh, uh, Rocky Mountain slides. I wish I did have a Rocky Mountain slide. They're a lot better than these steel things. Um, it's upstairs at the moment, I've just finished it, so.
Actually, to be honest with you, Wade Costenbader, who built this pickup, actually does a hell of a lot better version of that song. So go and check out his YouTube channel. Um, I'm stoked. I'm wrapped. I just, I love building these. These are just mega fun. Um, this is the uh, this is the next one that's being done. It's going to be a solid version, four string. Um, this particular one will be fretted. As you can see, we're we're almost up to the fretting stage. Uh, this particular one has been done with uh, Tassie Oak and. Um, mahogany wings on the uh on the on the on the top i'm playing around and experimenting with these at the moment and giving it all a go but um stay tuned there's a lot of very cool things happening if you're interested in getting one of these guitars um give me a buzz there's a they're comparatively i mean this has taken me about five weeks to build um i'm not charging a lot of money for this so just hit me up give me a call message me um yeah until i come to my right sensors and actually increase the price on these things so because uh they take a bloody hell of a long time to build but they're hell of fun that's why i don't want to give this to the customer yet but he's gonna want it <laughs>